Cousin Cassius IFL TV. In association with MTK Global, we're at the SEC Arena here in Belfast. I'm joined by MTK Global's Paul Gibson. Um, yeah, it was a, an up and down night here in Belfast, Paul. Mostly a fantastic night. Uh, unbelievable atmosphere like it always is here. Topped off by Carl in that performance, but yeah, the downside is Jamie Conlon. He's heartbroken in there. He's absolutely in tears, but listen, he's should be proud of himself. I think everyone in here is proud of him. He did everything he could. Got up umpteen times like he always does. But listen, and Cajas is, work, is elite world class, elite world champion. So, but apart from that, only positives tonight. Only positives. And we saw Carl Frampton there in a in a much tougher fight than we may have anticipated before. Well, I mean, Carl picked this guy. This is what Carl wanted to come back into. He could have easily picked someone easier, but. You know, he's at the stage of his career where even though he's had a long time out, he needs a proper fight. He needs something to get motivated for. He knew what he was getting with his Mexican was going to come forward all night. He was never going away, it didn't matter what Carl hit him with, but I thought Carl looked is a world class in places. Uh, a little bit of complacency here and there, but you know what you're getting with Carl Franklin. He's, he'll be back in the world title shot very, very quickly. An impressive performance from Paddy Barnes tonight. Best I've seen Paddy, I think. Best I've seen, I think. Uh, Paddy needs to get a little bit worried about his opponents to fight like that. And the guy weighed in four pounds over yesterday, so we knew he was going to be a big guy. But uh, yeah, Paddy was class. Paddy was class. I mean, very good. Who would you like to see Carl Frampton fight next? We know Josh Warrington is here in the crowd. Scott Quigg's even here as well. Quigg Silver, Warrington Silver. It's in this division. All the fights are there. I mean. Why not make Warrington? I think uh, I, I think Carl wants to get out again around springtime next year and a big night at Windsor Park in the summer. Um, so let's see. You know, maybe maybe if Carl wants Santa Cruz, Carl wants to go to Santa Cruz. If that could happen at Windsor Park in the summer, everyone's happy. But listen, only big fights for Carl for now. Just finally, Paul, you obviously just recently joined the MTK Global team. So how's how's that been going? Fantastic. I mean, I can't claim any credit for tonight whatsoever. I'm, I'm just here to observe tonight. But listen, there's a new management has come in. New investors have come in, putting a new structure in place. And uh, you know what MTK has done the last five years is just unreal, absolutely unreal. But it's time to kick on now. We can get an even bigger, you know, proper business structure in place. Listen, there's no limits. There's no limits. So big, big 2018 for MTK. Absolutely. Paul Gibson, thank you very much for talking to IFL TV and I'm sure we'll catch up with you soon. Absolutely. Cheers, Cougar. Thanks. Thanks.